Let's see. I don't think that there's anything wrong with weeding with mouse. But I don't think there's an, anything wrong with weeding with the Sidui. Either the advantage of mouse would be that we don't have to deal with, like, the Heatran as much. Like, Heatran could outspeed the Sidui, but I doubt it does. I'm going to lead with the Sidui because that Pokemon's fucking cool. And I'm going to lead with Urshifu. And the Rilla can only fake out one of us. Right? That's the idea. Do I want to leave with Mouse, though? Is it Mentor? But it's so hard to say which, what it's going to be. That's a good lead, though. Um, I think I'm going to bring my Mouse, though, still. And I'll bring Shenpao. And we'll see if these guys work together. So let's go into it. And let's see. Let's see what their team looks like. Again, we don't know if that Slowking has a Mental Herb, and we don't know if it's Sashed. We don't have the Ghost Terras on everything to be able to correctly not get fake out cycled here so we have ghost terra on the decidui in case we need it but let's see like realistically they could just like fake out the decidui and like fairy terra to block the urshi you know what i mean there's so many ways to get out of this uh this is a propeller tail bear scooter no fake out bro you good you good homie this guy this guy this guy good you good i don't know about this one chief your decidua is so fucking cool. This is so sick, bro. Yeah, that's fine. Propeller tail ignores redirection. Decidua is so cool! You're gonna terrestrialize the Heatran into something, and I wanna see what that is. I wanna see if it's like Fairy Terra. Again, I was talking about this earlier. Heatran's one of those Pokemon that you have to terrestrialize to actually have it see play. Note that we did not need to click the close combat here. We we're completely okay. Sidui, big protects up, bro. And you can fake out the Urshi. You can totally fake out the Urshi. No fake out Urshi, huh? That's good damage. Woodhammer. Are you double dipping me, bro? You gotta, you gotta click Heat Wave here. And even if you do, I get to bring out something good. And you can miss that Heat Wave. Let's see it. Survey says, any missers? Cool. So I used Urshi, but they took a lot of chip on Rilla and they took um, a lot of damage on that Heatran. And they showed their item of orb. So they showed that they still take half your soul. Like Shempao's a good bring in here. It really is. I wonder if I can KO that Rilla. I'm gonna double into the Rilla. I don't think Rilla has Protect. No way, bro. No way, bro. We could Trastalize the um, Decidueye right now. I don't think we need to. I think that Heatran's Protecting. Oh, no Protect. That sucks. We will be able to get this guy off the board no matter what. Citrus? Oh, dude. Maybe it's a good thing I doubled into that slot. Is that actually the fabled Citrus Rilla? Hello? Is it me you're looking for? Even with that, dude, even with the citrus, we're like, bro, where are you looking? Homie, don't play that. Eight times. We mean you need all ten. Triple errors is great damage. Yeah. Any flinchers? 30% chance. Defense. I don't know if they still can flinch. Okay, heat wave. Decidui! Oh, dude, Decidui almost taking the biggest L. I mean, it did take the biggest L. Mousehold also almost taking the big L. Let's see. Heatran's gonna take some chip. I think we're still fine though. As, as lame as that sounds, Heatran actually gets ticked out from his orb. So we can actually just ignore the Heatran and let it like hit the Shenpao if we, if we need to. I didn't want to Trastalize the Decidueye. Slow King, there it is. So this is a weird situation. We already saw Citrus, so they can still have like a Pinch Berry, but what I'm gonna actually do here is just Ice Spinner the Heatran, take away the terrain, and I'm just going to try and KO the Slowking. Remember, we have the Shen Pao Shred, the Defense Shred on that Slowking. So, like, the normal Terra Mouse Hold should be able to do it. How's it going? It's going absolutely flawless. About to be popping off with Mouse Hold Shen Pao. And let's see what we get. Let's go. Wide Lens Pop Bomb Mouse Hold. This is straight degeneracy out here. 
There's a Protect Heatran. Don't really care about that. So Ice Spinner blocked. We, are, we already talked about Bear Scooter. Yeah, uh, the Perpetual Terror ignores redirection. So this should KO, right? They already Terrored, so like... Bro, you're so gone. You could have like three Pinch Berries. I guess I have the 1% chance to miss my Pop Bomb, right? Because it's 99. Okay. <laughs> Duo Hudon comes back in the uh, DLC. It does come back in the DLC. So that's sick. I wonder... The last one's going to be Glass Trier, right? I wonder if Mousehold, like, Oko's Glass Trier. Oh, and Amoris. Oh, it's that in Amoris. All right, I don't care. It's like, oh, oh, it's that in Amoris? You mean in the I don't care in Amoris? I don't care in Amoris. All right, yeah, we got it. I think we did a good job of not needing to terrestrialize the Decidueye, because actually I wanted to lose that slot to open up the spot for Mousehold to come out, because Mousehold was the, the key component in, in checking that sloking, so it's really, really good. Yeah, we'll see how this works. Decidueye is actually super pog here. We super effective into that Zorak. I'm going to leave with Decidueye, actually. That's fucking sick, right? We just scrappy Oko like everything. Is there an issue with these two? I don't think that there is. You have Fake Out, and I, and I don't really care. There is potential for Tailwind here, so we will be potentially Tailwinding with the Decidueye. And then the last Mon. We don't need to bring Barrascuta. I'm going to... I want to bring Mousehole, but it's so, so bad versus most of these mons. This has Protect. This also has Protect and can be a secondary Tailwind setter. I'm going to bring the Barrascuta. They have an Ursaluna, a Skeledurge, and a Cleavor, dude. We clean up. And, and like, what is it? The Roaring Moon? We close combat that? Dude, it's not. Dude, Barrascuta is actually super pog. If you've, if you've ever played with one, it's really good. Hope all is well, my friend. Glad to be able to catch a stream. Elementary, elementary school finally ended. Yo, are you in elementary school? Are you a teacher? <laughs> Did I know that? Congrats. Congrats on school being out. All right, so Cleavor and Sneasler. So I don't really care what they do to the Urshifu. I actually really don't. Um, I'm going to try and tailwind here you can you can totally fake out the decidueye you are a teacher that's why i thought i was like i'm like you're not a small child you know <laughs> what grade do you teach again that's super cool arthur yo five subs already five big subs holy moly yo absolutely popping it off i actually really think decidueye is good is that is that am i bad am i bad i think decidueye is the best one um thank you though i appreciate it i appreciate that so much and i hope that uh I hope you're, you're ready to have a really good summer. I'm going to actually Wicked Blow here, because I think this is where the Zorak would be. Let's go, Wicked Blow! That ain't Zorak. <laughs> Yo, that ain't Zorak. Better than Typhlosion? I do think it's better than Typhlosion. Holy shit. That's fine. Stat dropped over there. So, Cleavor can do something. Are you going to Stone Axe my Decidueye? That's resisted, bro. That's re is that is that wider? Holy moly. Okay, Tailwind. You just Tailwinded me with your Cleavor, bro! Can you not Tailwind me with your Cleavor? Do I ask nicely, and then that Sneasler used its item. That's actually so tech. Okay. Yo, I, I saw them out there. That's sick. Thank you again. Five subs. That's so amazing. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Let's see. What do I even do here, then? Like, if we can come in here... Yeah, that, that uh, Sneasler guy is going to be a pain in the butt. All right. Oof. All right, here we go. Yeah, but tomorrow we're going to be using Iron Valiant and uh, Hisuian Electrode. Yeah, let's see what happens here. Um, I think the key to playing... The biggest key to playing Shenpao correctly, I think, is correctly baiting them into over-respecting that slot. And yeah, they're just making the right plays. Yeah, we just take the L. We take the L. Sneasler absolutely... The white herb. Close combat play. Plus the... I didn't think they... I didn't know that that guy got Tailwind. Right? No fucking idea that thing got Tailwind. I don't see how you come back from that. I don't actually see how you come back from it. Let's see. Is there anything we can do to come back here? Does Scythorn tail when it does? Yeah. So it makes sense. Alright. 
This is the only thing, and I'm hoping that they acrobatics, but they're just gonna close combat, right? They're just gonna close combat. I'm hoping that they acrobatics, thinking I might have like a grass terra or like a bug terra. Dire Claw, that's a poison move, right? Yeah, you see, like, we're playing to our outs. I'm like, we just had to hope that they use the literal wrong move, right? We just had to hope and pray, living on a prayer that they use the wrong move. And they did, <laughs> you, know, you know what I mean? And we take those. Yeah, I bet you can just teach a Tailwind in this game. It doesn't have to go through all that trouble to TM. So, Chris, how goes it? Yeah, you, we, we brought it back. And let's see if they bring out Zorark. If they bring out, if the two of the same Mons here, that means Zorark's on, Zorark would have been the first one that sent out. So like, if they send out a second one and it's uh, Ursa Luna, okay. Let's see if there's a booster here. There is, if it's attacker speed, really important. Attack boost, cool. They already Terrid. I feel like this is my one shot to get something off the board. Oh wait, they didn't Terra. I'm an idiot. I'm such a fucking idiot. I thought they Terra'd already. That was the last game. Flying maybe? I mean, I closed combat. That's such a shit play. Steal! All right, we're good. We're good. We did it. We're, we're good. We're good. Oh my gosh, we're so lucky. <laughs> Bro, close combat, baby! Oh my god! Let's go! <laughs> I mean, he turned into the same type that he had a weakness to. So, uh, dude, we got, we got fucking lucky in this game, boys. We brought that back. We got outplayed so hard by that Sneasler. But the Steel Terra Barrascuta literally carried. We, we got carried this game. We haven't even, like, won yet, but I think we win. Right, um... Hope you're well. I'm doing great. Yeah, Drain Punch is fine. We got the Sashes up. They should have went for the Barrascuta. Ashes up. Dude, Barrascuta busted out here. Holy moly, let's go. And I don't want them to, like, Dragon Dance do anything weird. Tailwind Peter's out there, Tailwind Peter's out. Dude, I cannot believe that we won this one at all. Even a little bit. Let's go. That is sick, dude. That is a crazy comeback. Wow. Dude, Barrascuta busted. Dude, imagine if they had, like, a Fairy Terra. We just took the biggest L. But they went Steel Terra. That's funny. They were, they were trying to block the ice attacks, and I'm like, nah, fam, it's CC baby time. That bear is is going to give them nightmares, bro. All right, let's actually think about what I want to do in this situation. I actually really don't hate Decidueye, but I also really don't hate Dragonite here. I think Dragonite's actually way better than it looks on paper. Dragonite, Urshi's good. I'm going to bring the Decidueye in the back, even though it's probably not correct, and Shenpao. Let's go. Muck is cool. I agree. Muck is awesome. All right, let's go. Let's go. And let's see if we can keep the win streak alive. We're undefeated right now. Undefeated with Hisui and Decidueye. What is this? It must be my birthday. And so I really like opening up Urshi here because it tells them to like over respect that slot. So like right here, that Flutter is just dead unless they're sashed. And even if they are sashed, like I don't know how much we care. Let's see if they get speed boost or a special attack. Special attack, so they're dead, right? Um, and they could go with, like, realistically, the right play would be to double into that slot, like, E-Speed plus the Wicked Blow, because you would guarantee KO it. Dude, just fucking do it. What are you gonna... Dude, what are you gonna do, bro? Where are you go? Where are you gonna go? What are you gonna do? What are you, gonna, you gonna go Fairy Terra? Huh? Huh? You gonna go Fairy Terra? You won't. You won't click that button. And, and you know what? I don't care if you click the button because I click Wicked Blow. So it's like you either don't go Fairy Tear. Oh, dude, are they doing it? Bro! <laughs> E-Speed D's! E-Speed! I E-Speeded your ghost type, bro. Let's go. Whew! Bruh. Oh, that's thick. That's a thick boy. Cause he's always been a thick one. I should have, I should have normal Terra. I should have committed to the bit more and went normal Terra. Bro, that was sick. No, I, I'm not gonna lie, that was clean as fuck. 
All right, Urshi's down. Why do you think a Suing Decision is better than the other two? It's just good. It gets Tailwind. They know the other two don't get Tailwind. Poison Jab's fine. It, it can't poison us. Dude, we're holding. Watch, he's like, ha, I got him. And it's like, you ain't got shit, bro. Remember, I e-speeded your stupid fairy, your ghost mon. Should've just committed to the bit a little bit more. Let's see, I think the Sidua is just a good mon here. We don't need Tailwind yet. I want it, but we don't need it yet. So let's think about how I want to deal with this. You need to e-speed that slot to keep it honest. And then they're going to protect their Flutter and attack my Dragonite. So in, if that's the case, we then would want to just Tailwind here, and then next turn we can like flinch out the Muck and do stuff like that. But also, like, we can just flinch the Muck here with triple arrows. I'm fine, tri I'm fine flinching the Muck here. It got a special attack boost too, so it's not full... It's not full speed. Oh, they just take the L. Cool! Dude, that's a free... That's a, that's a trade. We take those. We don't need the Tailwind yet. I should Tailwind, but like I'd much rather flinch or like crit or do something super cool here. That move looks so sick, bro. Defense drop. I don't know if you can stack the effects. Really, poison? You're ignoring my Dragonite. <gasps> oh, that's so much damage. Like, it's super effective, but, like, I'm not... I, I have some bulk. Okay, well, that changes things. I'm very sad that my Decidueye is gone. I could have just Terrastalized. I guess I still can. Tornadus. All right. Do you guys think we Oko Torn? With a uh, Ice Spinner? I think we do. You can. You have a chance to get all three. Okay. All right, so we got the defense drop, though, right? Banded? I don't think he's banded, but, like, he might be banded. That probably KOs. Shimpao Shred plus the defense drop, he's probably dead. And then this would KO here. Yeah, Muck's strong. I wonder if this is a Sash. I wonder if it's Sash on the Torn. If it is, we're going to be able to clock it, and then they're like, what, the E-Speed? Let's see. Let's see what the last mon is. I wonder why they bring out Torn right now. The last mon's probably Basque Legion, right? That's kind of what we're thinking. We're thinking it's the Legion of, of Basque Legion. So I'm happy that they're not just pivoting out Muck to block the E-Speed. I want to see if they go, like, Ghost Terra on the Torn. Right? They didn't tear it. Yo, they tear, they tear the Flutter. I'm such an idiot. That's what I get for playing. It's, it's too late for me. I'm, I'm an old man. Bro, that is a lot of damage. The Azzle video was so much fun. Yeah, I made two videos with that team. I like that team a lot. I want to see if you are sashed. Rain Dance. You're dead. Unless you're sashed. And then I would just E-speed you. And then I would just kill your Basket Legion. Oh my gosh, dude. Are we going to come back again? Is, is Decidueye, like, the secret sauce? Alright, so the... The right play here is to go Sucker Punch, Tailwind into like, my Sucker Punch is then faster than your Aqua Jet, right? That is the correct play. Has to be Basket in here, right? Remember when Pinchberry's healed 50%? Yeah, I remember Muck. Muck was stupid. Muck's still stupid. He killed my Decidueye. Dude, they're thinking about it. They're like, dude, this is the seventh time that you've brought Hyper Offense to class. There's the Basket all right, let's go. All right, so we tailwind here. They didn't make bad plays. I just outplayed them. All right, we should be fine. I'm trying to think of like any situation where we aren't fine here. This should be a two shot. They they could I guess get to a situation where like, um, they I guess they can get to a situation where they go for like 50 50 PP stalls of sucker punches. I don't think this KOs. Oh my god, dude, why? And you're so when using Basque Legion. You need to EV train for that one. You can actually not die to that. It doesn't take that much investment. That's why we don't use the full speed basket legion sets. That right there. You can also EV train to let yourself live like the Urshi sucker punch and stuff too. Oh, dude, dude, dude. dude we could use the thing. He has a redirection, man. We can hit, we can hit that Ting Lu in the fucking mouth, bro. I can do it. I can hit all of those. I'm thinking about it. There's nothing really wrong with Dragonite here. I actually don't hate Decidueye as a lead. I actually think Decidueye, or she's just kind of cracked. And then you need to bring the Shempao with this team. And then I'm thinking to myself, I don't want to bring Mousehold to fight Garchomp. I 
I think you just bring... I think the Dragonite's really good, but I think I'm just gonna bring Barrascuta. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, I can't keep getting away with this. I'm gonna one-shot your Goldango with a Triple Arrows. Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm excited for this. Dude, I've been... I've waited my entire life to one-shot this Goldango with a Triple Arrows. So show me what you got. Show, show me Goldango in the back, though. This is fine. Chef's Kiss levels of, of greatness here. They're going to click... I, I wonder, what is the Orthworm going to do? I'm going to CC the Orthworm. I think we can actually do a lot to it. And I'm just going to Tailwind. I guess I could just taunt the or Orthworm. But I want a Tailwind. Yeah, I have, I'm fine with this. I did not get the Shiny Gimme Ghoul. I did not. I did not. I'm mad they went in Genies and Birds, but not Tapus. Tapus are kind of busted, though. Like, I'm, re I'm not ready for them to have Terrain Wars yet. You got to trickle feed that stuff in. Tapu Coco is cracked. So is Lele. Ghost Terra? Don't need to. Why, why would I Ghost Terra here? We are Ghost Terra on our, uh, or on our, um, Decidueye. Are they going to Ghost Terra, you think? I, I'm just crappy. Is that Electric Terra? What the? Hello? Is it me? Is it me you're looking, you're looking for me? He doesn't do shit, so they're gonna get their thing. No, that's not a thing. That's a, that's only something I've done. <laughs> Earthquake, so they get their heal up, and then they're gonna be able to shell. What is that? Shell something? Shed, shed tail? Or she holds. Orb chomp. Cool, cool. That's fine. This intro looks so cool. Did you see that? Just that pose, dude. My boy out here. Body press. Oh, dude. They didn't click the shed tail, dude. I let them click that button, and they're like, "Nah, that's on you, bro." I wonder how much damage I do to it with the decidui. I don't know if I want to taunt it. All right, all right. You ready? You ready to make some plays, boys? Watch this shit. The disrespect of Garchomp. Out, out, like, unbelievable disrespect of Garchomp here. Can't believe that didn't fucking KO, bro. That Garchomp has... I can't believe he clicked Earthquake. I, I actually can't believe it. He's orbed. He has no Scarf. He has no Terra. I'm, like, actually just sad. I'm, like, actually sad. There's the flinch, we take those. All right, so I, I ain't messing around anymore, buddy. Don't root for this guy. He's, he played with disrespect. All right, now I'll kill your damn Garchomp. If you wanted it dead so bad, you should have just asked. All right. And you have a defense drop now. Oh, yes. Oh, Decidueye, let's go. Didn't you disrespect Chomp? Yeah. I'm the hero, though. I'm using Hisuian Decidueye. All right, let's see what they got. Are people urged to protect? I mean... They should have just swapped the guard Chomp out. That's the thing. He should have just swapped his Chomp out. I, I don't know why they didn't. You could have just swapped in a Chi Yu there, bro. Rage quit? Ah! I mean, their whole that whole board, like, they already used their Terra, right? No, nah, dude, this was over, bro! Oh my gosh, dude, that was so over. Dude, that's straight no shot. <laughs> Let me think about this. Town Flame's weird. I'm gonna lead with Dragonite. And, yo, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. I'm gonna bring Dragonite into Urshi. And then, I know you have to bring Shen Pao. I don't need Barrascuta. And I don't need Mouse Hold. So that means we're Decidueye and end up. Decidueye is sick because it's, it's such a good mon at swapping in on Spores and then r absorbing it with the grass, uh, grass Typing and then just taunting the Amoongus out. So it's really going to be cool. Yo, how goes it? How goes it? 
What effect are you talking about? Are you looking, um, are you talking about the Decidueye move? The Decidueye move is cracked, bro. It has a high crit ratio, 50% chance to drop their defense, and a 30% chance to flinch. It's so good. Do you think the Sui form is better than the regular form? On Decidueye, I do think that this one's better. Scrappy is a really good ability. Scrappy is like an ability that can just make any Pokemon good. Um, but regular Decidueye is cool too. Ghost is a, a good type. Dude, we should use regular Decidueye next. Regular Decidueye has, uh, has been fun to use over the years, too. I think I know who this is. So, let's see if they're good. Their team looks solid. Gutra um, Amoongus is great. Alright, so th this is going to be the weird part here. Are they going to be bad? Chat, do you think they're going to be bad? Yes or no? Do we think that they will perform suboptimally? I'm about to find out. All my homies perform suboptimally. So let's see. You can Earthquake here. I have a Dragonite, so that's one of the reasons why I like Dragonite was to disincentivize Earthquake. If you want an Ice Spinner or Rock Slide, you're, also, you're not really doing that much to the Urshi. So we led with a really sticky lead. A lead of like Sash Urshi plus um, potential Sash Urshi and, and uh, Dragonite. Yo, thank you for another follow. Appreciate it. E-speed. All right. So this breaks the town flame. So it doesn't have gale wings anymore. And then our Urshi outspeeds. And there's like no way they could have seen that coming. They would have had to go ghost here. And if they did that, yes, they would have gotten tail of tailwind. But they still would have lost their town flame to the Urshi there. Rock slide. There's a rock slide we were talking about. And so they never got up their tailwind here. So now because they never got up tailwind, you, we don't care about them. Even a little bit. We can kind of just do whatever we want. And Amorous. Good Pokemon. That's fine, right? Yeah. I'm okay with that. Oh, the pivot. I thought about I thought about Wikipool on that thing. Is it a Moongus? Let's see it. Yo, Blue Hog, how is it? I'm, I, I wanted to Wikipool that slot so bad. We're gonna go we're going normal terror on this Dragonite just so we don't get KO'd by like a Moonblast or like some sort of weird play. If you wanna like superpower me and be like contrary, I think that's still fine. Um, we're just doing this to get static damage in that slot, and then we're going to send in Shen Pao, shred their defense even further, and just ease beat it next turn, probably. Look at Blow's good damage here, believe it or not. Like, that's still amazing damage, and we can just keep, like, that, it's gone. Cute charm, bro! What? Oh my god, dude, not like this. Can we freaking not? Can we, can you just kill the Urshi thing? <laughs> yeah, thank you. <laughs> I'm so happy that thing's gone, bro. <laughs> oh, dude, I'm so happy that thing's gone. All right. Because this is when I get to work on the TCG Good Energy. Yo, happy to hear it. Okay. Um, the right play is to go... Well, we actually don't care about Protect Them Spore into the Decidueye. We don't actually care. I'm just going to go Shenpao. I think Shenpao's fine. It's about my gift and stuff. You appreciate it. I appreciate it. I want to make sure that we can KO. And if you wanted to Spore my Dragonite, I don't care because we have Lum. So we can still double dip this. So we just E-speed there. And, like, we still have a Tailwind up, too, so, like, we're super ahead. This Ice Spinner should KO the Amoongus because of the Shred, but, like, we'll see. If they level, like, one, that's fine. We have Decidueye in the back. And the fact that they, they their last Mon is Tusk, and, like, we don't really care about Tusk. Oh, they're gone. I'm gonna laugh they Rage Powdered, dude. Maybe they think we don't have E-Speed because, like, we set up Tailwind, but, like, let's see it. Should we Rage Powder? Ah! <laughs> dude, this, guy, this guy's getting a clinic of how... Extreme speed is a plus two priority move. It's a plus two priority move, which means it goes before Gale Wings and it goes before Rage Powder. That's crazy. No, I want to say that that's the correct EV spread for Moongus to have to live against Shen Pao in this format. It will still live the Ice Skull Crash too, but what that does not live would be like a um, a Ice Terra Shen Pao version. So like that's one of the reasons why we still have Ice Terra on this guy. E speed actually busted. You did hear that here first. So we're just gonna E speed that guy and. Um, I think the right play is to double dip into that because I don't think I think that they're scarfed or like some sort of choice. How would you rank this meta versus previous gens? I don't know. It's hard to say, right? It is kind of hard to say. And if they want to rage powder again, we would just KO it. 
yeah, I don't know how I feel about it. Um, you can use whatever you want, but like there's not going to be any like real tournaments for 99.999% of the player base. It's a good spore target into the Shen Pao, but like we still win with that Dragonite. All these people in Psychic Train? I've been spamming like, uh, I mean, I've been spamming freaking Ice Spinner this whole time. And Amorous was flying, right? So I could have E speeded it regardless. We stay undefeated. We brought it to Sidgewai. We just didn't need to use it. Mousehold's just there for the damage, bro. I'll show it to you. I'll show you the value of a. Ah, Mousehold sucks here, though. Yo, thank you for the follow. Thank you. Or sorry, it's a sub. Six months. Yo, Nightstream. That's right. What do we want to bring here? Dragonite is good here. It just can't really hit like some of those. And Barrascuta kind of can. Liquidate's good damage against most of these. I don't know how I feel about... I don't, I don't really like the Verascuta here. I think Mousehold's probably better. And that's sad. Mousehold's not good here. All right, let's try it. We might have to take the L. We've been playing this team for like an hour. We haven't lost a single game. Let's see. Let's see what happens. Thank you, though. Thank you. Six months sub. Appreciate it. Hope we're having a great night. Dude, we've been doing night streams, man. Do we think the next format will include Box Legends? Nah, I think it's just going to include whatever Pokemon are in the uh, new DLC. I'm not going to play whatever format uses like Kali and Zacian again. I'm not playing it. Y'all can... I won't do it. I won't do it. All right, all right. They are going to absolutely end my life, right? I'm doing this, guys. I'm fucking clicking the button. Don't tell them. Shh, shh, shh. Don't tell them. You're going to go Steel Terror, right? How am I going to stream? Don't know. I actually, I actually don't know. Probably not that long. Yo, what is up? Not much. Not much is up. Oh, dude, they're going there. If they one-shot my Decidueye, we lose, by the way. I should have let Dragonite, dude. I should have let Dragonite. Ah! You ever just should have let Dragonite? You ever just know that you should have let Dragonite? Sad. Dragonite would have been taunted so hard, though. Versus like, they won't taunt the Decidueye, but they'll just fucking kill the Decidueye. They're going to go Tailwind and just make it rain. Oh, they just clicked the Bleak Wind. That can miss. That's a, that's a huge misplay, by the way. That's so sad, bro. That's such a misplay. I mean, I could just Ice Spinner and done whatever I wanted to do with the Decidueye. Ugh, that's so dumb. All right. Fine. And then they don't even get the stat drop from the Make It Rain. Ah, oh, that's so frustrating. I mean, if they're going to be bad, like, if you don't want to Tailwind, right? Like, I can't make you. This is wrong. I mean, it's the only thing we do. If they have, if they're going to click Tailwind, they can click the damn Tailwind. This is the only play that I have. Ah. They read the Protect, but you didn't need to Bleak Wind. Like, why didn't you Tailwind? Or, like, Rain, Rain Dance or Taunt or do, like, something else? I feel like this is such a sus game. This is, like, a really, really sus game. That Grassy Surge is gone. Now, let's see it. We still have Mouse in the back, which isn't like a terrible Pokemon. If we can get the Golden off the world, we're like, we don't know what the last Mon is. There's the Tailwind. Like, they should have done that last turn. There's no reason why they wouldn't do that last turn. You know? Okay. Sash here? Or are they just dead? All right, so they're dead, and no more terrain. Click make it rain, fake out Shempo. I mean, it's the only play that we have then. I wonder how much damage Sucker Punch plus Sucker Punch does the Golden Go. Think I have a KO? Oh, 
I'll see what they do. Wow, fake out the Urshi. Wow. It's not me. It means I could have just attacked though with Shimpao. I could just kill the Goldango with a Sacred Sword, bro. That's a. I'd say that's a. They don't know who's scarfed. But now they got the stat drop. I wonder if my Urshi dies to the minus one Mega Rain. What do you guys think? Do you think they're gonna switch? Do you think the last mod is Basket Legion? Do you think they're switching into Basket Legion right here? Because we could double. Oh! Yo, 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 yo! Let's go! Oh! Dude! Let's go! Dude, we out here. We are out here, boys. Oh my goodness, we're out here. U turn's great, but like, we don't die. You know, you say allowed that, bro. I don't think he saw that coming. This is their last tail one turn. Zapdos. Okay. Fake out. Shen Pao. Is that grassy seeds? The hell. You know I'm gonna protect the Shimpao. You know that I'm going to. Fuck this guy, man. Fuck this guy! You can hit my Urshi all you want, bro. Hit it. Hit the Urshi. Hit it. That's fucking right, bro. Get out of here. Get. Go on, get. Go on and get. Hopefully it dies. Please die. Bro, we won! <laughs> you can't disrespect me all day. You can't disrespect me all day. You can't disrespect me every single turn, bro. Okay, one's gone, right? Woo! That was a spicy play. Dude, that, that, that took a lot of risk. I threw the game in the garbage. I took the game and threw it in the garbage. Woo! We take those wins though. Staying undefeated out here. We need to lead Dragonite here. I don't want to lead Dragonite here, but we like have to. And I want to lead with like another Pokemon that has Protect. So it should be Shen Pao, but I don't want to use Shen Pao so early. And like, I guess it could be Decidueye. Let's just go Decidueye then. And then we need to bring these two in the back. There are arguments for Barascuta here, and I think Barascuta is not bad. Oh, this is going to be so hard to break that Sneasler, bro. I don't know if we can break that Sneasler. I don't know if we can break this Sneasler. We're going to try. We're going to do our best. Let's see it, though. All right. Let's see what happens here. This guy's a great team. I think this is a rental, too. But we'll see. Torn Flutter. All right, so the last time I fought this, I should have just like overcommitted and like e-speeded the Flutter and normal Terra. Let's see. You're gonna click D Gleam. I 
I don't think there's anything wrong with this just yet. Oh, shit. Are you tailwinding, though? Are you taunting? Are you taunting me? What are you- are you just clicking Bleak Wind to break my Dragonite? That's not a bad play. It's not. Tailwind. Cool. It's fine with me. So they see my Iron Head here. I can have my cake and eat it too. I want Tailwind and Iron Head. This guy's like, ha, he can't set Tailwind and use Iron Head. I, I can too. All right, don't kill me, bro. You can, can you just not kill me with like Bleak Wind plus that D Gleam? He's not Trastalizing here. So it's like, maybe we got shots. Sunny day. Okay. Let's see what you get a boost to. I, is it speed? You're dead. Special attack. I'm not, I, I don't think I'm dead. I think I hold. We holding out here, boys. We trading tailwinds. Could have tarot normaled and sent Shenpao in one shot of the torn. I mean, that's they, they're probably sashed, right? They're probably they're probably sashed on the torn. I think I think that's I think that's big sash torn vibes. And our Dragonite, I don't think Dragonite Oko is torn. Cleaver. All right. So our Tailwind is longer than theirs. It's thicker. So they have two turns left. I don't think there's an issue with the double protect here. I want to see what they tear it into as well. In that kind of same play, I'm going to make that play next turn where I pivot in the Shenpao and try and KO, but I don't think we will. I want to see if it's Scarfed too. All right, it's Scarfed. It's Scarfed on that guy. Okay. That changes things. Bleak Wind? So Bleak Wind and Stone Axe. Okay. I have Urshi, right? I don't want to swap Urshi in on that, but I actually really like this. Okay. I, I see where this is going. I think we can... I think we can make this work. Swap in... E-Speed almost KOs. I don't use Cover Cloak on my Torn. He's stuck using Stone Axe. I don't have to care about his ass at all. You could miss with that too. All right, so the only thing this is going to come down to is does that Torn Oko us here with a Bleak Wind if it hits? That's the main question, which it probably does. Ah, damn. Oh, oh, we holding. Yo, we are out here. Decidui big busted. Let's go. Yeah, that's fine. That's ab that's totally that's really really good. So the tail one peters out, right? I think this is like low key okay. They're gonna have to swap out, and they're gonna want to retail one, right? They're stuck. You're stuck using Stone Axe, so we, we don't care about that guy. If we don't care, oh, they probably think they just outspeed us. Just kill him, and then. Yes, they tried. They, they tried to attack because they didn't know we were scarfed. We take those. So uh, we still actually outspeed that cleavor, which means we're gonna lose our decision by this turn. But we denied their tailwind for the rest of the set. We're gonna take that guy. I'd love a flinch, but we don't need it. Oh yes, and a defense drop. No, beggars can't be choosers. And now that Chiyu's coming out here, I think this is like super okay. We don't know if they're tr like what sort of set they are. I'm assuming that that Chiyu is Scarfed, right? Last turn of Sun. It is scarped. That's we might lose. Ah, 
Ah, dude. I, we might lose, bro. I think we lose, actually. Yeah, we, it's game. We lost. It's the scar. It has to. They have to miss a heat wave. They have to miss heat wave for us to have a shot here. Oh, it wasn't scarf tailwind. It's, actually, I thought the scarf was on the cleavor, right? To be faster than the torn. That the cleavor was just faster than torn. So we take the fattest L, because like I thought the cleavor was scarfed, right? Am I wrong for thinking that? I don't think that I'm wrong. Wait, what? I don't understand how that happened. Hold on, did I like miss something here? How is that thing faster? No, the Chiyu does have a scarf. Just the cleaver was just faster than the Torn. That's a weird one. The only play here is that they double into the Shen Pao, and they like they like Heat Wave and then like Stone Axe, and they miss the Heat Wave in a Decidueye. The Torn's just like full bulk, yeah. If they miss a heat wave, we got shots. Is it my lucky day? Survey says. Whoa, dude! Whoa! <laughs> <One>. <laughs> the maximum degeneracy. That's a plus one tech. Play to your outs, boys and girls. You never know, you just might get them. You never know. Bro, we take those. Whew. It's like, I would have won if I didn't miss Heat Wave, but I'm like, yup. And we stay taking those wins. We stay, we, we undefeated. We won every single game. This team's busted, this is why busted.